is easy to make. You can be as imaginative as you want when you create a smoothie with your favorite flavors. You can use so many different types of fruits. For example, today I'm using bananas, blackberries, raspberries, and um, strawberries. But you can be creative and use whatever you want, whatever fruits or vegetables you want. So today, in hopefully five to eight minutes, I will show you how to make a fruit smoothie. I will show you the ingredients, how to prepare it, and how to blend it all together. First the ingredients. I have yogurt, orange juice, and all my fruit. You can add honey or condensed milk to sweeten your uh, smoothie, even if, even after you've used all your sweet fruits. Um, there are a lot of cool benefits you can receive from these elements. For example, yogurt can aid in digestion and intestine function, reduce high blood sugar, and help to prevent osteoporosis, which is a disease in which your bones become fragile and are more likely to fracture. Orange juice helps with arthritis pains and decreases high, chole high cholesterol. And the fruit or vegetables are just good for you in general. After you've taken out your ingredients, you'll need to measure them. You need 16 ounces of yogurt, and this is a 32 ounce um, container, but I've already used half of it. So I'm just going to pour it all in here. You need um, two sliced bananas. This is only one. <laughs> Maybe. So I'll have to slice another one. Um, two, one cup of sliced bananas, Strawberry. strawberries, <laughs> and a half a cup of blackberries and half a cup of red raspberries. Hmm. After that, you need one cup of orange juice. And I would have brought ice, but I didn't think about it um, to put in. If you do have ice, which most of you do, you use a cup and just pour it all in. Um, and then you can toss all your components into the blender and blend it.
Now mine is a little more on the liquidy side, so I probably shouldn't have added all that yogurt or just add more fruits and ice. So today I have given you almost everything you would need to make a really good smoothie. I've shown you the ingredients, how to prepare the ingredients, and how to blend them all together to make to get a perfect taste. And now you have a healthy alternative that tastes great.